In this video we're going to discuss passing all the observations you make in your video time study into the time study uh, reporting module here, which is actually a piece of the uh, PDA support, the iPad and the Android support uh, module as well here. So how to do that, we go back to the summary screen here, and we select this option over here, say reporting, and then we click on the OK. And that's going to take the data and dump it out into Excel. And here you can see all the information has been placed into Excel. Um, it's just given the name of the study and so forth here. Here are all the observations you made. Here's the elapsed time. You can write down here. So everything is in here. It's been dumped into here. You go to the main menu. And then you go to generate reports. And now you've got access to all of the different reports that we provide standard with the product. So for instance, you can select your raw data. And the raw data is always indicated by the underscore raw. Any sheet that ends with underscore raw, is a raw contains raw data that we can use here. And then what we're going to do is click on the, uh, let's say, a time study summary. Click here. Give it a couple of seconds. And it's going to summarize the report for you right here. Right. And then we're going to come back over here. Back to the home again. Main menu. Uh, generate reports. You can generate other reports. Here's observation cycles. Let's put it into a format very similar to what it would be as if, if you had uh, taken it manually. And uh, Other report here you might be interested in. Again, back to home. Main menu. Generate reports. Uh, final standard. This will give you the opportunity to write in frequencies. How often do you do it? So you can put all of that information in here as well. So you can also do uh, design your own reports in the main menu, new designs. These are all covered in the uh, in the PDA support uh, reporting module area of the uh, videos here. Notice when you pass the information over, the raw data here is passed into a sheet called reporting.xlsm. Uh, you would want to save that as some other name to save it for your own purposes. Everything that's passed from the Video Timer Pro into the reporting We'll go into a sheet called Reporting XLSM. So before you leave here, when you finish your reporting, be sure and do a file, do a save as, and give it another name and put it wherever you'd like to save it as a being a summary of this particular study here. Again, we'd probably recommend that you keep your summary reports in the same folders where you're keeping your actual uh, video analysis and so forth, maybe under a separate subfolder, that type of thing. But be sure, the main thing is be sure uh, when you send over to Reporting, to do a file and do a save as and give it another name so they're not all called reporting that will become very very confusing for you.